It was music for a good cause tonight in Aiken. Four bands taking the stage for a very special concert, raising money for a teenager wounded in a shooting at the Walmart in Aiken. Sydney Hood was there to tell us what 14-year-old Ashton Reichard and her family have to say about what all this community support means to them. Ashton and her family are so thankful for the community support they've had in the last couple of months. And tonight was actually the first time she had the chance to go on camera and say thank you herself. The welcome she got coming in shows just how strong that support is. It is so nice to see you walking up here on your own. Wow, my, my, all these people were here just to support me and help me. <laughs> just to see everyone come together just to help me. It's crazy. Four bands joining forces at the VFW Post 5877 for this fundraiser. Complete strangers showing up to celebrate. They were here to rock it out. <laughs> we have a great support group just as our family and friends in general, but that grew the night all of this happened. And it hasn't stopped. This community isn't only Ashton proud, but we're Aiken proud because we come together and we support our friends and our community. There, there's no second guessing this. We, we had to be here to help out as much as we can. Because this little girl went through the, probably the worst thing of her life. She definitely, um, is more of an overcomer of what she's been through. She's a survivor. She's yes. strong. With an even stronger attitude. She's she's an inspiration to us. I know other people say she's an inspiration to them, but she's an inspiration to us. But to Ashton, she's just another teenager. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess as relaxed as you could be, but I'm getting back to normal. Prayer does things. Things you don't know it can do. And looking at Ashton tonight, you can see how far she's come in a short period of time. She recently celebrated her birthday. She turned 14 on August 1st. She was able to go to school on the first day of school and start high school with all of her friends. She still has some recovery ahead of her, but she's finally starting to see a sense of normalcy, she says. And it's great to see her tonight looking so healthy and being celebrated like that in Aiken. Thanks very much, Sydney, for the update.